trailer boat diesel heater 101 680 Haynes on court port side under the passenger side pocket there it is up in there siliconized five glass tubing for the heat on the exhaust combustion air below that 150 degree rated um, grey water tube it's just connected there the fuel line up there protected from the heat off the exhaust another bit of siliconized uh, tubing the duct goes around and through there and comes out the companion weight jump out of the way George Ducting, high temperature stuff. And it can do a tight radius, it's got a stainless steel coil in it. Tight radius. Right so it can come into the jab in here. And we can put it into the wheel here. So, perfect. Exhaust goes through the speaker and then into the side of the pocket. It's hot, but it's got another layer of, of uh, fiberglass glass tubing there, so it's protected. It goes through behind, excuse me, Charlie. Through behind there, under the bed, and off the transom. When I'm not using it, I, I pull that. Uh, muffler off and uh, put a, a bung in it. A little fuel tank from Whitworth's um, anchored in strap. A fuel pump there which I'm going to suspend off some cable ties I'm told. We'll make that a bit quieter, it's not too bad anyway. done in a smallish trailer boat and when you turn a fishing to have that warm air it'll be great down in below here I've just got it on control switch just in around the back of the companion way here straight in there and that's ample Keep things dry when it's uh, misty. I'll turn them up. Easy control. as hot as any other fan heater. Just cranking up the volume now. There's no smell to it. It's pretty good. A vague new smell but that's it's disappearing. Full ball now. This is 
exhaust tubing I used from Briley Ho. Invented a reasonable sort of radius. That's the material used for the uh, insulation. High temperature siliconized fiberglass tubing. And for gaskets, uh, through hole gasket, you can get a sheet of this material from um, industrialised, uh, specialist industrial manufacturing, I think they're called out in Sutherland Street. It's uh, rated to 455 degrees or something like that. No, no, it's 500 or something degrees, he was telling me. So that's good. And the uh, combustion air tubing, that, that can be in a reasonable sort of radius, and that's rated to 150 degrees, the Italian stuff. And Bunnings, pay a little bit more, 35 bucks, I think, for. Um, uh, 35 bucks for 5 metres and uh, here we go so we can that now that's the same temperature just um, more volume I think it's a bit hotter it is hotter actually yeah, you know, I can hold my hand there get it close right there you can't hold it that close, that's hot. And then just turn him down. And it just slowly pulls itself as it's turning down. So, yeah, tuna fishing offshore, Tasman Island, in comfort. Not right. Recycled plastic, uh, fairly dense. I'll just cut it down to height so I can get it in there. It's just to maintain 130 mil between the centre and uh, the top for maintenance, but uh, it's only for maintenance. I can get that out fairly easily to access the top if I need to. And uh, all the uh, electrics and stuff, difficult to uh, route. Straight down under here. Spare one there, bottom left, uh, 20 amp. Uh, so I've got the positive from there. The negative just combined with all the others. It goes up, folds up. Uh, routing all your stuff in under there. 